Content Curation A Technique for Influence One of the hot topics today in internet marketing is content curation. Content curation will help you build influence with your community, fans, and followers. The key hallmark, to my mind, that separates content curation from simple sharing is that content curation usually involves an addition of comments or more information from the one who is curating where a simple share is just a repeat of what the original poster originally shared. So, for example, it might be considered a straight share when I retweet someone on Twitter or share their update on Facebook. Where a simple share becomes a form of content curation is when I add my own comments or thoughts to the retweet or share. Something like, very good article or I'm attending this event, I hope you will too. These types of additions serve primarily a social-slash-relational function. A more robust form of content curation occurs when you reference someone else's blog post and add your own list of tips and strategies to it. This becomes a way of filtering information and presenting the best of it to your community. Building influence develops your position as a thought leader. Introducing content by filtering is an influential building process. As the rate of content production increases and people feel more and more overwhelmed by information, the most influential leaders will be the ones who filter best. To gain a position of influence and leadership within a community you must engage in filtering information that is unique to that community. A better way to become an influencer is to create and curate your own content. You can build your thought leadership by developing relevant, timely, unique, and captivating content that serves your target audience. You can curate your own content periodically by reintroducing a valuable post or reigniting the conversation around a particular topic. I in the beginning, content curation was a method of creating new content, but it also became another method to build influence. By curating content, you are subtly allying yourself with the original content producer. By submitting a new format for your content or discussion allows you to control and direct where attention and focus goes and, when you can direct attention and focus, you clearly have influence. When you become the content producer of your target market, the ultimate goal is to produce content that everyone wants to share. Make it interesting. Have an opinion. Use graphs, images, infographics to make your point. Make content enjoyable for your niche market. Calling attention to what someone should know and then guide them on what is not important. To the extent that you can help people interact with your information in a productive way, while guiding the conversation so your community benefits, you will be a curator with influence.